Okay, so here we are with the Dodge Grand Caravan. This is a 2010 with 285,000 miles on it. It's a fine example of American engineering, and I've matched it up with the Kentronic Servo Hydraulic Actuator, another example of American engineering. Hello, Leo Tech fans. We're back in Leo's workshop, and today we're featuring the Kentronic Servo Hydraulic Actuator. As soon as you get into a design where you need thousands of pounds, lots of force, you start getting anticipating tanks, hoses, valves, lots of stuff. Intronics has solved all those problems. This is a servo hydraulic actuator complete. There is no tank. There are no hoses. This is a, this is a hydraulic piston actuator. It is powered with a positive displacement pump and a servo electric motor. Servo means position, velocity, and force control. Instead of tanks, hoses, valves, this actuator can, will replace all those, and they have a full catalog. This is probably the smallest unit. My, this is my servo uh, demo unit that I carry around. These are available 1,000 pounds, 50,000 pounds, up to 150,000 pounds. They have an entire catalog that you can view on their website. They can be short, they can be long, up to 15 feet long, even longer. They can have coordinated motion. They're run with a controller or PLC that can be supplied by Kintronics or, or supplied by system integration. Now I was looking around the workshop and I said, I wanna demonstrate the Kintronics unit and I need something really heavy and I'm, Looking around and looking around, aha, I see a minivan. And so we're going to apply the Kentronics. We're going to lift the minivan and just show you a, a little bit about it. Okay, so here we are with the Dodge Grand Caravan. This is a 2010 with 285,000 miles on it. It's a fine example of American engineering. And I've matched it up with the Kentronics Servo Hydraulic Actuator, another example of American engineering. We have two programs loaded into the, into the servo hydraulic actuator. One is a simple stroke program, and the second is a force limiting program. So we're gonna try them both, and we're gonna see what happens. I brought the camera up a little closer so you can see what's going on. Let's run the program. <laughs> So there's a simple stroke program, lifts the car without a problem. The next program will be the force control. It gets to 50 pounds of force and it stops and maintains 50 pounds. Well, I hope you enjoyed our little experiment in the workshop. Until next time, this is Leo in Leo's workshop. Adios.